have to build this database. The following questions relate to data risk management. The owner of the car dealership uses a stock card system to record details of vehicles in the inventory. Retrieve the database called dealer and perform the following tasks on the table stock card. The data should reflect what is shown below. So retrieve the database called dealer means that they are giving you the database called dealer. So apparently they're not letting you create the database from scratch. They're giving you the database. So I will try to create it very fast. Oh, the make model registration number and color. Right, so we need to go in design view, view, design view, name the table. After create the database called stock card, I want to put make model registration number and color. All right. Let's see if I can add in some, some of these cars. All right. So for those of you all watching this who actually have to do the exam, the practical exam, you don't actually have to do this importation of data, but I need to do it because apparently the question said they're going to give you the information. All right, so now I can actually do the question. So the question has all of these things here, which is the data should reflect what is shown below. Yada, yada, yada. It shows me all these things. Insert a primary key using the most appropriate field. So the most appropriate field that I'm going to use for the primary key is obviously registration number because registration number is the only one that has um unique um values so i'm going to go to home go to design view and go by registration number click on registration number and then click the little key on top here and boom registration number is the primary key when i go back to data sheet view it's going to ask me to save and i say yes and it accepts registration number two marks in the bag Add one appropriate field name and data type to the table. Oh, we could put engine. We could put electric or gas. So I'm going to go to design view and I'm going to add a field now called electric. No, sorry, engine. Engine type. And I'll put it as short text. And I'll click yes as always. And the engine type I'm going to put in is electric or gas. So yes, two marks there. Oh, this database is real easy work. The report below is to be generated from your database. Create this report and save to your database. So I need to be able to sort it by make and then model registration number and color. So we're going to create our report now. So to create our report, we're going to click create and I'm going to report wizard. Right, so I open it up report wizard and I'm trying to get a report to look like this. It's sorted by make and then model and then registration number and then color so let's add those things to the report make model registration number and color so we add all four of them Ta-da! right good next we want to um ask what do we want to group it by we want to group it by make so we put in make first that's how you're going to group the things by putting in make and then you click next do they have any alphabetical order or anything like that a b m all right so yeah it's it's in alphabetical order by make all right so we're going to next and we're going in ascending order by not group by make all right cool so next we don't have to put anything in ascending order let me check again pce pcs pbh a s a s x x c e e all right so model is going in alphabetical order because we have an a here and we have a s here so you have to be kind of careful by to make sure it goes in alphabetical order so let's start with a uh, model we put model in alphabetical order now i click next and i leave the report as steps so i'll just name it stock card report and we click finish preview the report and it's supposed to look like haha -ha! so this is the report here so right good so we just got three marks there suggest one database feature that can be used by the dealer to simplify the entry of new vehicles in their details to this a form yeah because to simplify the entry of new of new vehicles and their details yeah a form Describe one validation check that could be used on registration numbers as they are entered. The validation check that you could use on registration numbers is um, format and length because registration numbers have a particular layout. You must have the three letters and then you must have the numbers after.
So it could be a format check saying that the first three things have to be letters and then the next four things have to be numbers. Identify the database feature that could be used to arrange the registration number of vehicles in ascending order. Sort 